Really rocked on that song for you didn't. Okay, listen. Welcome back to the five. We could tell that we're getting near the end of the show because Bob's now getting his segment. When the super committee was first announced, Congress also asked for recommendations on how to trim the nation's debt by more than a trillion dollars. I've said from the beginning that they'll be able to pull up, pull it off. But today is the deadline for those recommendations from Congress to their super committee. But it seems, for the most part, that lawmakers now just want to be sure that their own budgets don't get cut. Uh, let, me, let me sort of explain this to you. The, the Congress of the United States was asked to submit, by this date, to the Super Committee, their recommendations about how you go about doing this. If you add up every recommendation they've given them, they've increased the budget deficit <laughs> about $15 trillion. Now, uh, everybody's covering their own butt, particularly the Defense Department, as usual. And Leon Panetta, my old friend, who's now the Secretary of Defense, who used to be a little bit more have scrutiny on the Defense Department, this is what Panetta had to say about uh, mm -hmm. the f potential defense cuts. Do we have that? It's going to take us to the edge. And if suddenly on top of that we face additional cuts, or if this sequester goes into effect and it doubles the number of cuts, then it will truly devastate uh, our national defense. You know, I, I ran uh, Panetta's first campaign for Congress, and we ran against the Defense Department the entire time. And by the way, I'm sorry, producers, I, you did get that up quicker. They were yelling at me because I, I yelled at them. The fact of the matter is that this is what the problem is. The reason you needed a super committee is because the Congress and its various committees can never do anything but protect their own turf, and it's showing itself. When you look at these recommendations, the only way you can get something done is by a super committee. I mean, otherwise, you're going to get marred in this protect my own turf. And now it's one of those things where the, uh, one of the reports today was that a lot of the congressional leaders were um, advising the super committee to go slow on these things and to take their time. And it was one of, I, I thought, the super committee sounded like a good idea at the time and now everybody's realizing wow the rubber is going to hit the road in about six weeks when they'll yeah, have to and, and, and a lot of democrats are saying just take that failed obama jobs bill and add some tax increases did and you, and that's what we want you, but you mentioned that the that the defense uh organization is very organized and they are and let me tell you why they were out there first to the gate they're not used yeah. to getting cut their lobby is very organized unlike the other side and it's bipartisan Right. And, Unlike and, the other side, which is entitlements. Entitlements are used to getting cut. Well, the healthcare no, industry is used to getting cut. And let me give you some intel. The hospitals are up there feeding the nursing homes to these members. They're just knifing each other in the industry. They're not or, organized. They're the, totally the, fragmented. The defense industry, you're right, is used to getting what they want. Do you realize that next year the United States will spend more on defense than every other country in the world combined. Well, and, thank goodness that's because someone has to. Yeah. Well, no, it's the only thing the government does that works. Oh, it does work? Yes, it actually have you ever, works. Have you ever seen... It's because now, bureaucrats it, you, aren't involved. You think that Raptor really works for those two engines of two different the, companies the don't The work? drones work. What else, Bob? We're going to spend more the, on regulation. The EPA's budget is $8 billion, more than every other country combined, too. So don't, don't go there. But $8 the billion? Thing that's thing what they're the, paying for one airplane for the Defense Department. The interesting thing on... On this little uh, recommendations to the super committee, the Republicans want balanced budgets. They want oh, individual balanced budgets. Break. What did the Democrats want? Balance Spending. this. They don't have Spending. No, Henry they want Waxman. Tax increases. Well, that's the point. Hen Henry Waxman. Tax increase. Henry Waxman proposed 16 billion dollars to create jobs. So now creating jobs is the code for more taxes. Yeah. yeah. They're just skipping. Oh, they're they're yeah. lying through their teeth. The, they the, want the, more the, taxes. Dana, the, the one thing about this, uh, the bill that created the super committee was that there would be, if they could not reach a decision by the end of November. To be brought up for a vote, there would be automatic triggers that would cut into domestic and defense spending in 2013. That's real. You can't undo that. It's two thirds of the vote to do that. You think uh, they're going to? That's enough to force. Wait, you think that's enough to force these guys to get it well, deal done? It De defense is the one thing. When we, it's domestic spending on the other side, but it's in particular Obamacare, and so uh, the Democrats have. An incentive to try to make sure that they protect that. And then on the defense thing, it actually is quite bipartisan. One of the reasons, as we've talked about this before, is the number of like defense bases, like DOD bases in your district or in your state. Mm -hmm. You're going to fight for those, and that typically isn't a partisan thing. You, you can also hire, as the defense industry does, virtually every retired member of Congress has got a job yes. from, the, uh, th from one of these big But arms, uh, a lot uh, of the members are coming out, and they're hinting at it, but McCain was more direct, saying... 
I know that you said that these triggers are going to go into effect, but we'll just vote to nullify them. No, but it takes, two, th it takes two thirds vote, though. That's well, different. Well, look, if everybody's industry is threatened, you might just get that. Well, I don't, I'm not so sure you Everyone's will, but pet projects, I should I, I've say. just been told we have to have a tease, but I'm, I'm not going to do it. <laughs> okay, coming up, uh, we've won. We being the Wall Street protesting. Yo! We're here, we're back in New York City. We're here to stay because they don't have to leave now. Greg will give us the glorious details next, and Arabs will be crying. Pieces. I learned the path to heaven is full of sinners and